guys, it's Voodoo Ropes and I'm trying to put together a video at 10pm and I just noticed that the sound in my video is completely fucked up and that is why here is the intro <laughs> Today we are going to do a beautiful tie with my beautiful friend Zoe. Zoe. And this is a tie that was inspired by Carnival in Rio that is unfortunately not happening, but I have a childish a childhood dream to go to Rio for a carnival and I was like looking at the costumes and I tried to put some elements of the costumes together and make a harness that reminds me of the carnival and here we go i hope that you enjoy this video with uh, a lot of wind and uh, birds in the background <laughs> hey guys it's buddha robs and my beautiful friend zoe and today we are going second rope and now we're going to build the harness so the harness will start from here so here we need to make sure that our knot is going from kind of like from up to from the front behind the ropes <laughs> so up and behind like this and now we have a that we need to put this rope through so put it through make sure that this is the middle of the rope because if it's not you're gonna have your harness be a little bit messed up so from the previous photo shoot it was so close to the blue rope Alright, so here is how it's going to look. And here, I'm going to make one knot that is a pretzel knot. But if you want to Google how to actually make it in a slow motion or something like that, this knot is called a double coin knot. But pretzels are pretzel. Pretzel, pretzel, so tasty. <laughs> right. So we did tie with Zoe before. I'll show you how many times. Two times. Three times. Three I times. Think. Okay. Three. Yeah. Uh, one time super random on the beach. Ah, it's easy. Yeah. So yeah. One time on the beach. <laughs> then the next day in the house. And then again on the beach. Oh, yeah. Oh, no, so four times. Well. Because on your rooftop and then on the beach yeah, again. Yeah, and then on the beach. That's a lot. <laughs> Oh no, I'm almost. 
plot knots. I'll show it now after I finish this beautiful pretzel. <laughs> pretzel right and now if you want to do just a flat knot and not bother yourself with trying to make a pretzel flat knot is a like a you cross your ropes and then you put this rope through the loop and uh ta-da this is your flat knot or this so just something like this doesn't look that pretty but it works <laughs> this rope and we don't really want to touch it yet but this one we need to tie it in the middle uh, two times just regular shoelace knot here Okay, 
because this rope is still going around. Tiny bit smaller. Yeah, this is done. Okay. <laughs> uh, so, I need to use 
sorry. <laughs> so now I need to continue with the neck thing. So we have this little loop here, and I need to put my rope through it. From here, I don't need to tighten anything up, like no tightening because it's the neck. Neck is very important. You don't want to break it or I don't know, leave, leave your rope marks that will burn and stuff. No way. <laughs> so from here, I will just go to the front. Turn again. <laughs> All right. So um, I want to make this like little wi wings. I would call them wings. I don't know. They're not really wings, but whatever. <laughs> so that's why I want the first one to go a little bit, a little bit higher, and the second one will be lower. So the most important part here is to secure them in this part of the rope nicely. And of course, you can just wrap it around, and it will be like, okay, I did it. But let's just do it pretty. <laughs> so to do it pretty, we need to put this rope wrap it over this one and to let it out on that side also I'm trying not to catch any hair into the rope so I don't pull the hair <laughs> yeah I mean, it's always like pulling her hair right now herself <laughs> so I don't have to do that <laughs> <laughs> and now I put this rope going into this direction. I hold the loop with my hand and I wrap this rope around here like this. So it's coming from behind. And here I have this loop.
How do you feel? Great. Secure. <laughs> you can race too? Yeah. With the corset and stuff? Yeah, this would be a cool going out outfit. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. That could be pretty awesome for going out. Yeah, actually, it's pretty comfortable, I guess. <laughs> <laughs> and you can always add more stuff. For example, I have a purple rope here, and if I want to decorate that, I can always put a little more rope starting from here and then I would put it going like all the way here. Like